Hello everyone, in the previous video we learned how to use segmented button objects. In this video we will learn how to use switch objects. I designed an example to understand how switch objects work. We will add two switch objects to the desktop window. The first switch object determines the appearance of the window. When the second switch object is active, the first switch becomes dysfunctional. We will do the project with you from the very beginning. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to support us. So let's start. I created an empty desktop window. I will create a frame object. In the previous lessons, we learned how to create the frame object. You can learn the details from the playlist. The parameters sent to the function represent the physical properties of the object. I am doing the bind operation with the pack function. A frame object of the specified dimensions has been added to the desktop window. I will place the two switch objects that I will create in the project into the frame object. Let's create the switch variables first. I am using the string var function. I will synchronize these variables with the switch objects. I am creating the object with the switch function. As with other objects, the parameters sent to the function represent the object. I will use the first variant here. I am doing the bind operation with the pack function. I define the task function with the specified name. Now I will just use the pass command. Added first switch object. Since we haven't coded the task function, it has no function yet. I will create another switch object with the copy paste method. I set this switch object to lock. I will change the variables accordingly. Two switch objects have also been added to the desktop window. Now let's code the task function. I can access the state of objects using the get function. If the lock is not active and the mode is changed, I will change the mode for the desktop window. If the lock switch object is in the on state, the application image will not change.
Let's test it. The app image only works when lock is in inactive mode. In this project, we learned how to use switch objects. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and subscribe to the channel to support us.